Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a quick one. This is going to be a tutorial for this golden cut crease look and I hope you guys like it. The palette that I use for this tutorial is the Tarte Cosmetics Rainforest of the Sea Volume 2 palette and uh, I hope you like this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thumbs up and let's get started. After applying my primer, I use the Shadow Kong all over the lid and everywhere. This is going to make all the other shadows blend a lot better. The second shadow that I'm using is Marina and I'm applying it in my crease. The brush that I'm using is the Y15 brush from Morphe Brushes. Using the same brush, I'm applying the color Seaside in my crease again. I'm blending it out so there are no harsh lines. Now I'm using the Pro Glitter Liner from Tarte Cosmetics in the color White Gold and I'm applying it all over my lid. To make my crease darker, I'm using the shade Siren. Next I will be changing my mind and turning this look into a cut crease. And uh, you will see in a minute how I'm gonna do it. The eyeliner that I'm using is the Tardis Liner from Tarte Cosmetics and the brush that I'm using is the B12 brush from Sigma Beauty. Now as I said, I changed my mind about this look and I decided to turn it into a floating cut crease. So I'm using that Tarte Glitter Liner again and I'm making the cut crease shape. Now I'm applying the color pearl at the tear duct using the E35 brush from Morphe Brushes. I'm using the color siren and making the cut crease line darker and more defined. And I'm applying it with a tiny brush. This one is the E35 brush from Morphe. And I'm just going over that cut crease line and I'm making it darker and blending it. Next, I'm applying my mascara and false lashes. These are the House of Lashes Noir Fairy Lashes. And this is the finished look. I hope you liked this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thumbs up. And I will see you in my next one.